Hello folks, this is Harrison, Ult Harrison Ultimate Gaming, I'm Brian Harrison, and today we're looking on, we're back on GTA 5 online, we're looking at my arcade called Vidya Gin, Gin, Gindum, yeah, anyway, this is the arcade, this is uh, w the one I liked, I actually like this one, that's why I bought this one, I like this one better. This was my first business, the one that actually I was making passive income, and that's why I like the arcade. Besides you doing the casino heist, that's what it's a cover for, but it's also good. You can earn passive money from people being in your arcade playing games. So we're here going to look at that. So let's get started. When I'm here, I just park here. That's a nice area, a little like your own little personal parking spot. While you're here, I do that. Here we go. We're gonna go inside. Uh, we're going to see what the inside looks like. So here we are on the inside. Uh, hold on. Let me get my helmet back. There we go. Now we're here. I had to come in here earlier to turn off the music. You know, you have nice little glass doors, you have candy. I hear your little entryway, at least that's how mine enters in. I don't know how anyone else's, it may change a bit for you. But if it does, then, you know, that's what it is. But this is my favorite one. Here's the games. Uh, there's a lot of repeats because I do wish one thing, they would have allowed you to use all the games you paid into, but they didn't. You can only use certain ones, and so uh, there's just quite a few repeats. But there's still, the whole point is that you're making money, so... And then you can see there's a bunch of different games. There's even a place. Look, you see a few people already over here. Um, Michael's children help you. Here's one of them. He's, see, there he is, um, drinking beer. You'll see him if you, if you um, do the story mode, you'll see him. Or Anyway, there's Arcade. You know, the Arcade logo. Yeah, Video Again Arcade on the screen. Then there's... You know, some more games. You know, cool art. Um, and then there's Axe Fury. I need to try this. That'd be kind of fun. And then here's a, you know your trophy case. I have like one already. So um, you know, racing games. There's there's just different little cool games, fighting games. Some of them are reminiscent of earlier games, you know, just, you know, like this little, uh, what was an arcade, you know, and then here's motorcycle racing too, more, uh, just some, some cool stuff, this is basically arcade, here's a place where you get drinks, and stuff, I think most of these are for drinks, I'm not sure if you can get anything else, beer, you know, soda, it is GTA, there's alcohol reference, if you play this game, no, it is for mature. It is for mature audiences, but it's fun. I love it. So here you are, manager's office. This is where you will have your office. It is fun to play. Here's bathroom. You know, nothing real special <laughs> necessarily. And oh, that's funny. Hello, stranger. Yeah. Some some of the stuff. Anyway, here's some cool pictures and stuff. So I think they're just making fun of. It, it's kind of cool. It's kind of cool. So anyway, let's go into the office. Um, here's where you. This is your safe. This is where you get your money. See, so I come here. Safe. You know, follow instructions to open the safe. It's not hard. And uh, there's my money. I get five thousand dollars. I think it varies from five to ten. And then if you leave it long enough and you don't really look into it, then it can do more. Um, here's where you your computer. This is where you'd buy your games. Once you use this and buy the expansions and stuff, I've never had to use this. I ne don't even sit here and use this ever again. I mean. I could just sit there and look like a boss, I guess. And you can look out over your arcade and see. 
people talking, doing things. You can look over here. Yeah. Out of the view, even though there's the curtains are kind of blocking the way. Yeah. Here you go. This is your secret layer for when you do the casino heist. I've already done it once, so there'll be stuff there. If you don't have anything down there from the first time you've done it, then you'll I'll show you. It goes down like in this long stairway into this basement, and here you are. Here's your operation. Now this is the one of the add-ons. Is this computer? area that you can use to you know help resupply your businesses do you could do all kinds of stuff you could see what's on the screen but you could do all kinds of stuff I don't really use it much so that's just what it is and of course you have the lockers you never use they do decorate these things now this is because I did the casino heist so this is left over from that it stays there once the first time you do it there's stuff that goes away but there's stuff that stays too so, um, here's, you know, for instance, you know, some garage stuff. I mean, most of these, as far as I remember, are empty. Until you kind of add, you know, once you do the casino heist, you add a little bit more to show you you've done it, and you keep the stuff you've done. Um, here's where you can play. Maybe I'll play with this later and see what I could show you for fun. But here's where, you know, where you can plan your high See, I've already done it so I have all this m mapping stuff I mean it may already be there I freak I know some of the stuff comes in as you come like this this wasn't here I had to buy this and then when you're doing it you have the planning board and see now it starts over so you know if you were doing it you'd have stuff on the boards as you were doing it so you fulfill what's on this board then you would go to what's this board then you go to that board you know for the final heist here you know here's like a sleeping quarters this is where you sleep behind the board or you know safe house if you want to call it that's what it basically is it's not I guess you could permanently sleep here if you want to but it's not meant to be a permanent place as you could tell here's where you have your weapons and then your wardrobe is over here oh, kinda cool All right. so then you come over here and I'll probably show you those little drone thingies here later um, you come over here though here let's see let's actually go down the proper let's walk down the this walkway um you will like here's a keypad forgive this is hacking device required yeah I think this is so you can learn how to hack and stuff you do sometimes you'll get a vault I haven't been able to get the vault I, I think which actually goes over here so you can practice hacking into the vault and stuff anyway so let's look in this one I do have cars this is you're provided with the 10 car garage let's look at the cars I have sort of so yeah I have some nice car a few nice cars this one I actually kind of like uh, but I just I just stored some stuff here and then I have this one which has my logo on it it's it's the one that has guns in it if I remember it's the one I got from the casino heist after I won it or something it's I think it's this one is it this one has a guns I think this is the one yeah it is so yeah that's the one I got from the casino heist after doing it, I got it for free. And my friend got it for free too because we did it for him. So, and then here's, you know, another nice car. I don't think I've, I think, see, some, like I said, some of these are work in progress. Like, because I plan to do them all the same color, midnight blue, but the metallic because it has a shine to it. And then here's the, here's another car. I think I probably won this car. I haven't done anything with it. Yeah, some of this takes money. I was trying to get all the businesses, then I could do stuff. And then of course here's another car. It's a pretty nice car too. Actually, I do, and I like this car too. I forget if I. I've won some of these. I won some of these. I won spinning the wheel, and then I just had a place to store them. Um, that's that's a good thing about GTA 5. It, hopefully, it's in GTA 6 where you spin the wheel, you can win a lot of cars. So if you focus on buying property, then you could spin the wheel, and you unless you never win cars, and you're like, nah, I don't care to do whatever you want but I've won quite a few cars by just spinning the wheel so I haven't I've bought a few I've bought a few like, the, like except for like the holiday like this this is the Halloween stuff I bought this one um, I think my woman has this one yeah I think she has this one um, and then I got the hearse the only hearse I really truly like you know uh, that was last year's Halloween stuff these two cars um, is when I got them last year 
and this car was this year's um, Halloween after the Ghostbusters. And I haven't done much with it, so I just put it here. I may, I, it looks like I did actually repaint it. Uh, I'll have to check. I think I did repaint it. Yeah, I think I did repaint it, but that's about it. So this is your cars, you know. This is all the cars I have down here right now. That is all the cars. I think I actually did fill all these slots. And then, uh, yeah, this awkward car, which I probably won somehow. Yeah, you know, because quite a few of these, except I know these three I bought. And I don't know which one's over here. I know I want quite a few of these ones. Or I did, a, like, that one with the guns over there I did with the casino mission. You do get a car if you can sit, complete it. You know, they'll say, hey, we got a surprise for you. And then you go down, I think I want to say by the dock, and and you go and you find out you have a card and you take the card and you put it in your garage and there you go so if you uh, so be even me focusing on businesses not really buying a lot of cars i did buy buy any it's just i didn't buy it i didn't focus on buying them i did win quite a few you know or i got a few that i wanted for free by picking them up off the street so you can do that too um anyway oh let's go over here let's do one let's do this for at least one time let's see i'll show you let's it's kind of fun to... I think you could battle each other too, probably. But it's kind of fun to play this. Let's do this. Let's do this. Alright, yeah, so see, there you go. So, now you have this little drone thing. See, it's in front of the arcade. There's my truck. Let's see if I can... Oh, yeah. Let's see. Oh, did I blow myself up? Oh, maybe not. Okay, here, hold on. Let's see here. Oh, shock. Ah, I didn't do it right. Charging, come on, charge, charge. Oh, come on, no, no, no. Yay, come on. You can do it. Yeah, there you go. Knock out. Meet it on the street here. Oh darn it! It's fun to mess around with this. It really is fun. To mess around. There's my auto shop. Come on, hit the right button. There you go. Here you go. Oh, <laughs> yeah, they, it just shocks people. It's kind of funny. I guess you can detonate. There you go. But uh, available again, and yeah. So there you go. That was a little fun. Play, play that. Um, but this is it. This is the arcade. I don't know what else to say about it. I think this has probably been a long enough video. I'm surprised. I thought it was going to be a little shorter, but it isn't. Then you can kind of go back up. We'll go back up to our office here. Uh, yeah, it's just, it's a fun little business. It's my starter business because at the time, nowadays, if you just like you could start with a taxi cab. They didn't have all this or the motorcycle club. Um, when you, when I first started, they didn't have where you could repair the motorcycle or have the bar running. And now they have those. So if you start out with that, you you know, it's easy. Those are two easy businesses. That's an easy business to run. But at the time, I wanted some income when I first started, when I got started in here. And I changed to where you have businesses. Um, if you play GTA 5 on Xbox 360, they did not do that. You had to do all these missions and do all these jobs so you could her hopefully earn some cash to do, um, to be able to do or race, to be able to do, um, to buy stuff, okay? Um, so uh, in here, I guess we could sit down. They allowed, they allowed that. So it's just, you know, how it's been and I'm a, I like it so 
this is my first true business. I had to. I actually studied the criminal pack. I got the free office, and then this, and then I just got the office so I could do this. And then once I did get the office, I bought this and did the missions that you need to do. But back at that time when I did the mission, I had to go into open session. You don't have to do that anymore. But and it's just GTA right now. If you play GTA 5, it's a lot of changes. But this was my first true business for me earning any actual passive what I call this is a passive business for the most part passive income I mean you don't do much you just go in collect the money I already done the casino heist got money from that so now I just kinda sit here and collect the money uh, work on other stuff so this is it this is the arcade I hope you enjoyed it I hope to see you next time um, on another tour um, I hope to get most of these tours out of the way and then I do want to go back and focus on some aircraft and stuff like that because that's fun to fly around and mess around but I wanted to get these tours over with and we'll s you know we hope to see what happens um, I'll see you guys next time for another tour or uh, hopefully another tour um, until then mm -hmm. don't forget to comment subscribe hit the bell notification I'll see you next time mm, bye